Northern Cary Backyard, April 17th. Is there anybody out here with us tonight that is human or spirit and not an animal? If there is someone here with us, please give us a sign of your presence. You can speak into this recorder or hit that shed or do something noticeable out here to let us know that you're here. If someone was trying to communicate with Mona earlier, are you still here? Can you communicate again? If that's you, do that again. Did you just throw that at me? What? Did you just throw something at me? You swear? No. You didn't? You don't swear? I don't swear. <laughs> okay, so that was you. <laughs> if someone was trying to make contact with Mona earlier, can you please bang on that shed? If there's someone out here besides Mona and I and the cat, can you please make your presence known now? We've heard you out here before. Are you a man? Huh? I'm talking to the ghost. Oh. Is this your property? Were you trying to protect us the one night when the we had our tent and the coyotes? started howling? Hey, can you get a rock or something? And like, just throw it straight down? Like as far as you can? How am I supposed to find a rock? I'll find you a rock. <laughs> we need to get like some serious <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Like throw it straight now. I think you hit somebody's car. <laughs> Did you hear that? Uh -uh. The <laughs> Some person tells you to carry an eye for you to throw something against the shed or knock against the shed or hit the shed or something loud. Okay, back. Yeah, just like wherever you want if you think there's something back there. I just, I think I'm just bored with doing these woods, man. Marcus you know, would never once talk anything except for the coyotes. Well, that's not true, though. I mean, we caught that shoot thing, and then we caught that thing on his... Yeah, but that, that's that that when you scuffing around, or you saying something to me outside the tent. Because, I mean, you know, it's the only time we've ever been in the tent. So uh -uh. Thank you for listening.